Hello, this is Vicar Dave from Holy Trinity Lutheran Church with your encouraging word of the day. Today's words were contributed in large part by Kathy in New York. Forgiving another person can be a very difficult thing to do, but forgiving ourselves can often be more difficult than forgiving others. We tend to be our own worst critics, holding on to disappointment in ourselves long after others have forgiven us. Repentance is an important first step when we've gone down the wrong path, and the Bible reminds us to learn from our mistakes, give our problems to God, and move forward. From the Lutheran Service Book, hymn number 843, Forgive Our Sins As We Forgive. Forgive our sins as we forgive, you taught us, Lord, to pray, but you alone can grant us grace to live the words we say. Once we have received the Lord's forgiveness, we are forgiven. Full stop. There are no ifs, ands, or buts. We are forgiven. Now it's up to us to live that forgiveness with a newness of life and a new people in Christ. In 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17, Paul writes, If anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has gone away, and the new has come. Set yourself free. Confess your sins to the Lord. Receive the forgiveness of Christ bore on the cross for you, and forgive yourself to be the person the Lord is calling you to be. Let us pray. Dear God, today I am asking forgiveness for all the things I have done in my life that keep me from moving forward. I do not want to think of myself in a negative light any longer. Please help me to change the negative thoughts of myself, my life, and my situation by receiving and believing your promise of forgiveness, love, and eternity. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. Amen. May the peace of God give you rest this evening.